Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be doing this video but sad in another way because this is the Planners Anonymous Riviera kit and this is actually my last Planners Anonymous kit. I cancelled my subscription after oh, close to three years now I think and I knew deep down that if I cancelled it I would have cancellation regret and sure enough within days or weeks of me cancelling my subscription they came out with the PAU Planners Anonymous University kit which is just stunning and it's funny because I thought oh, I wouldn't want a kit relating to cheerleading and things but when I saw how much planner stuff it had in there I had major envy so I'm now on the hunt for that kit if you or you know anyone who has the kit including the sticker book and doesn't want it please let me know because I do <laughs> but the reason for my cancellation is because I haven't been into planning as much as I used to be um, I just haven't had the time with the kids to be honest and that makes me really really sad but I was building up a backlog of kits and with the cost of living going up as well I felt guilty getting the parcel every month um, so that's why I cancelled it but I think I'll have to rethink that <laughs> so I want to do a quick show and tell of what was in this Riviera kit I know I'm going to absolutely love this one because it's all my colours look at that this guy reminds me of George Clooney a little <laughs> so handsome so we've got come with me to a place where your worries will float away George oh my gosh George okay Sam did you design this guy to be George Clooney that is so weird I googled my symptoms and turns out I need a vacation <laughs> love that love that journal card all right so next up we have this gorgeous pen I hope that you can see the color of the barrel I'm just having a look how I would describe this very challenging color I would say it has a little bit of green a very slight tinge of green in it it also has a very slight cream color it's a really odd color I don't know how to describe it but we've got yellow and bluey aquary gems in the barrel and we've got the gold hardware on the pen all right now this must be our mystery item and I can already see that I love it immensely let's see oh wow look at that paper clip that is stunning so we've got this gorgeous little starfish gem and then we've just got some cute little um beads hanging off there and that is going to look really pretty in any planner spread i cannot wait to use that and if you're like me make sure you keep the backing cards that come in your kits you can actually use them to fill your pockets or to decorate your dividers in your planner all sorts of things if you're a card maker you can also use them for that okay all right so next up we've got the stickers that come in the standard kit let's see why can't I get grip of that <laughs> there we go all right so we've got here two sheets we've got the uh, decorative stickers and I'll just bring them up close so you can have a nice look there We've got our handsome George Clooney look-alike. I love kits that have um, scooters, uh, Vespa scooters in them. I really love it. And I love this little car. Now, I don't know much about the names of vintage cars. So I'm just going to call it a vintage car. But I love that one. It is so, 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 so cool. And then we've got here one week's worth of sticker headers that can go in your planner there. And we've got the date dots and we've got enough date dots for a whole month so you could use that to put here on your weekly headers or you could use the date dots in your monthly view to cover up the numbers that are on your monthly view in your planner depending on what planner you use so that's the stickers next up we've got our very cute stamps so I'll just show you the whole sheet there and then I'll bring it up close so you can see them so we've got vacay nothing to see here 
what a view we've got our mini george clooney our vespa scooter get lost we've got a bikini we've got our little yacht we've got some ice cubes and a glass there for your drink and we've got our gorgeous gorgeous vintage car and then we've got a checklist sunglasses beach relax and we've got butt sunshine then we've got a little paint swatch as well so if you're a card maker i reckon that these are just going to be absolutely amazing to use to create your cards if you're a planner some of you who post your spreads in the planners anonymous group do amazing things with your stamps and i'm always so inspired and i know i always say i'm going to try it but i still haven't right <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to move these things out of the way for a second because next up we've got all of our beautiful um, die cuts. So I'm just going to hold these up so that you can see them here. I love this floral dress. That is gorgeous. We've got a drink there and you can see the starfish on the side of the cup. Look at this gorgeous water fountain so pretty i have loved being a subscriber of planners anonymous and i think you all know how much i love sammy's work i'm just having a look which way this is meant to go there um i'm an absolutely huge fan of sammy's work which is why i was a subscriber for so many years um yeah so i know that it will be only a matter of time before i resubscribe Number one, it'll be if I just can't stand the um, thought of missing out on all the kits that are being shown off. Or it will be once I've actually used up some of my stash because it is getting far too big. And now that I'm getting back into planning again, it'll be fun to go back and use some of the kits, especially because they're not always some of the seasonal kits don't always match up to the seasons in australia um so it'll be nice to whoops there's some shells it'll be nice to you know go back and have a look and see what we received and use those ones up especially now that we're almost at the end of winter oh there's a globe with some flowers we're almost at the end of winter here in Australia, uh, so I'll be looking for some beautiful spring kits. This is definitely a spring kit in my opinion. It could be summer or spring, really any season. Um, look at that dress. It's not floral, but it's pretty. Same style, see? All right, we've got some more shells. It's a real vacay type kit. And I think having this in my planner will make me feel like I'm on a vacation, which is awesome. Look at that car. I just, I can't tell you how much I love that car die cut. It is so awesome. I've got this building. Sammy always has the most beautiful artwork. I'm not sure if Sammy does the artwork herself or if she has someone that helps her with it. Either way, whoever is doing the artwork on these kits is absolutely awesome and i just want you to know how much i love your work <laughs> all right so there's our die cuts so i'll just move those over to the side and next up we've got our washi i'm just going to unwrap these all right so i've taken the packaging off of our washies and i'm really excited to see what designs sammy has come up with oh wow look at that You've got the city or the village or town, whatever you want to call it. You've got your cruise liner, you've got your yacht, and you've got that beautiful house. And then it repeats itself. And I love that history on that. That is stunning. Wow, I love this and the water fountain. This one here reminds me a lot of Sunday Roasts kit with the um, mosaic tiles. I've totally ripped this, so let me just cut that. <laughs> All right, there we go. So we've got the tiles on there. We'll pop that. Oh, wow. Yeah, that definitely gives you the Mediterranean feel, doesn't it? Wow. I ripped it again there. 
And then what have we got? Hopefully, I think when we open this, it's going to be fairy lights. Why can't I find the end? Oh my gosh. Alright, so I finally got the washi tape open. Now I had a really hard time getting the thin washi open. I'm not sure if I just got a, a dodgy roll, but or if they've changed suppliers. But that was just tearing, just non-stop. I couldn't get it to open. But finally we have it open and we've got these gorgeous fairy lights and that just finishes off our beautiful vacation feel in the Mediterranean. So I'm absolutely loving the washi. All right, next up we've got the papers. And the first one I'm going to have a look at is the standard paper pack. Now, I don't know about you, but I actually haven't really looked at any unboxings of this kit previously or any sneak peeks i've just looked at the tile that sammy puts up for the kit and i'm blown away by the artwork now look at the detail i have to comment on this look at the detail in all these houses in the backdrop look at that i mean that is just amazing i mean that would have taken a very long time to create so that is really impressive i love that and on the back we've got the beautiful watercolor Okay, next up, I'm just having a look here. We've got your beautiful windows with shutters and the plants on them. So fun. And on the back, we've got um, a watercolour as well. Lucky last, whoops, sorry. Lucky last, we've got this gorgeous uh, floral. I really am obsessed with the colours. These are my colours here. So if you've been following along with me for a while, you've probably worked out by now that these are my colours. These are the colours that make me sing inside with so much joy. They just make me so happy. And we've got the watercolour on the back. And then we've got this sheet here of um, vellum and it's the shutter window design. And look at our acetate. Oh, oh, the mosaic tiles. Look at that. Isn't that stunning? All right, so that there was our standard papers. Now let's have a little sneaky here. Sorry, I've got some white cardboard there at the moment um, just to give me better light today because the light in my room is terrible and it keeps falling down. But anyway, okay. So next up, look at this scene. This is beautiful. This, I don't know why, just reminds me of Italy. I don't know, it's the Vespa scooter. I just don't know, but I just love it. And I think that's going to be my front page in my planner. I'll have to have a think about it. And we've got a watercolour on the back. It would be nice to see something different on the back of our pages instead of always a watercolour. Maybe a pattern would be nice. Um, I understand why Sammy does it, but it'd be nice after all the years to have a little change. And then we've got our paper here with the mosaic tiles. Again, very similar to the Sunday Roast kit, but totally different colours there. And then because I got the additional paper pack, I've got an extra vellum and an extra acetate. So that always comes in handy. And then lucky last, I'm just grabbing it and I've just dropped something, is my paper um not my paper my sticker additional sticker book now i've always purchased the additional stickers um back when they were just the loose sheets but now of course it comes in a, a little booklet for us which makes it nice and easy to store on the shelf sorry i was just picking up all the papers that i dropped because they were getting bent how they fell but yeah so here's our riviera booklet and I'm not going to say too much about it. I'm just going to flick through so that you can see the stickers. The sticker paper is quite thick on these, but we have a mix of paper and clear. So that's good. I don't actually mind the thickness. I know some people have been complaining because um, it's bulking up their planners too much. I can't say that I've noticed, but I'm going to be reasonably fair with that I haven't planned much this year so if it had been a normal year for me where I was planning every week I'm sure that I would have noticed it um if there is an alternative I mean it would be great if Sammy looked into it but I'm happy you know I'm not gonna complain about a, the thickness of a sticker because to me it's no big deal I can always take pages out of my planner if it starts to bulk up I love that we get some washi strips in here now 
this page feels unusually thick like there's two pages stuck together but I can't hmm, figure it out oh and then we've got our words in the gold foiling which is beautiful all right so that was the unboxing of the absolutely gorgeous beautiful stunning planners anonymous riviera kit i love this kit so much it has truly made me feel like i'm on vacation i cannot wait to use this in my planner it actually has got me really excited to do a new planner setup and that's exactly what i needed i needed that really you know a kit that really gave me that motivation and this kit is it so if you want to see what i end up creating make sure you subscribe to my channel because i always pop up a flip through of my new planner setups i know it's been a while since they've been coming up regularly but that will start happening again now and also make sure you're following along at stationery.happiness on instagram where i post my weekly spreads my happy mail my card making craft all sorts of things it's just a really fun happy place to be thank you so much for watching everyone bye